Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play King's Bounty with no fair fight. We're on the island of Tercon, where there are also dwarves, apparently. And we're getting gold, which is good because I spend a lot of gold for items. And I have the feeling that we'll need a lot of gold later on. So let's grab everything that is not exactly nailed to the ground. How about you coming with me, sir? Oh, he is. Didn't check what is for sale there, but we will. Let's outmaneuver this guy. Let's outmaneuver this guy. Oh, yes, please. Uh, the soap. We have three people that tested the soap. One was using it to eat it. One was using it to fend off animals. And you are doing what with the soap? You're making beer. Should have a decent head. Oh, he's talking about the foam. So he puts the soap in the beer to get foam. Oh boy, this guy's nuts. Do you have work for me? Yes, he has. There is a red dragon running around. Okay. Not like I'm gonna fight that guy. And he's not selling anything we need. Great. Okay. Ah, oh, the glasses for Bobor. I don't need Bonner. I'm not greedy. He just needs the four crystals to build it. That is costly, but I'll pay. Wonderful crystals, large and pure. Come to think of it, the shop is actually quite expensive. I shall No, you're not getting anything from me. Okay, he gives them to us. Beautiful. He's selling the ale barrel, which is pretty cool, because, at least theoretically speaking, um, the ale barrel together with the telescopic sight, and we know that that is on sale on the uh, Dwarven Islands, can give us plus three, minus three attack and plus 20 probability of critical hit with arrows. That is pretty awesome. The only problem is that the main uh, function of the uh, belly beer keg is to get moral up for dwarves, and dwarves don't have a lot of uh, ranged fighters. At least not those that count as archers. And when they're not archers, they're not useful. Okay. Uh, here we wanted to yeah we want to inform the guy about the soap. Maybe we can get some additional stuff on the way. That would be great. Wow, you're angry. You are angry, sir. Okay, whatever. Extra coin, deep thawed. Uh huh. You suck. Okay, perfect. So far, so good. You. This mission was succeeded. Yes, sir. And how is working on what? A perfect name for the soap. Special acid formaldehyde emold. Invented by yours truly, Guard. Safeguard. Yes, yes, exactly so. This means the soap should sting in your eyes and have natural smell to create strong bubbles. Thank you. That's all I need. Excellent. It's also simple. I might perhaps have a little Corsic soda soap to give it a sharper sting to the eyes. And of course, I'll add a strength, strength and cohesion to the adhesive. But for strong natural smell, why? Dried herring would... Oh, God. Dried herring. And now his new project... Something that turns diamonds into gold. That is outright stupid. And he's just selling dwarves. Oh boy. Uh, Mr. Dragon. Doesn't seem to have the biggest uh, action span, actually. He doesn't see me. Is that dragon blind? Well, who knows? Who cares? We get extra gold, and that's what we're in for. Woohoo! This guy is stupid! Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful! So far, so good. Um, the question is... What to do now?
There is that pirate guy. There is that other guy. Can we outmaneuver everyone here? Apparently we can. Okay, beautiful. Oh, there is a dragon. But he doesn't seem to be aggressive. Interesting. Leadership. Okay, okay. Talk to the Twelve. Keeper caught Tobos. May your soul rest in internal sorrow and peace. You look like a guy that wants a fist to the nose. And you talk like a guy who wants to want a fist and a boot to the face. Eternal sorrow, that's what you wish me. I'm not sure I want your blessing, dwarf. I'm in no hurry to enjoy eternal rest. Understand you, don't be alarmed. I only offer the usual greasing, uh, greetings of priest and s of sadness. My name is... So that if someone meets me like, I hope you die slowly, I'm from the temple of dying slowly, then that's okay, or what? Okay, whatever. I'm really intiquendary. Recently, Curator Dofus was taken to the land of eternal peace, and I was sent to replace him as a new custodian of the temple. That's sad, but that's the temple of sadness, I guess. Just prior to my arrival, however, the temple encountered some difficulties. The death of the custodian weighed heavily upon the priest, and they sank into despondency. The hopeless melancholia became obsessive, magnified as by the somber aura of this temple. It's the temple of sorrow, apparently. I'm much afraid that this gloomy atmosphere attached the unwelcome attention of the spirits of sadness. These spirits have taken over the main altar, and now the temple can only be cleansed by fire and sword, not by tears, so as it seems. Your assistance indeed would be useful, and the temple will repay you for your aid. Those who come to our temple in search and support will always be grateful. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no way we're going to fight these guys because intellect 13 and enough mana to burn us to hell. And this guy has attack 21 and dragons and a bunch of spiders, honestly. The question is how aggressive is that little guy? It's just polar bears, that's strange. Normally there is a variety in monsters. This guy doesn't seem to be aggressive. Why is that? Okay. Ah, he said talk to the dragon, so maybe we don't necessarily have to fight him. Whoa! But your action span is actually quite terrifyingly bad, my friend. Woohoo! He just runs... Oh, crap. That was uh, pretty close, because this guy is fast and deadly. Okay, um... I've gotten an achievement. Look at that. Look at that. Interesting. Seven more percent experience gained in battle. That's actually quite cool. Quite cool indeed. Oh, this guy again. Okay, let's lure him away, if we can, that is. Okay, good work here. Yes, we want to enter the mines. It's not that we want to do anything particular here, just loot the place dry. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Professor Numero. We don't want trouble with those guys. That would be foolish. And we're a lot of things. We're not fools. Okay. Let's get our butts out of here. And back to our ship. And then let's think. Think, 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 think. Um, the gemstone mines. And free the workers from their fears. Okay. It might involve fighting the giant robots, so we're not in. 
we cannot do that we cannot do this the statue of the dark warrior i know how i think to get the hands but not how to get the head because that means fighting the antidote is on Elon, and we don't have that but look at the experience 5610 and we get chains of war excellent um revenge that's not possible book is love the temple of joy is on usala island we don't have the keys to those glasses of old bobur we can do that that's 3000 experience the all of wisdom necro call we don't know where to buy that the cave of fog find scourger yeah we're a little bit behind here i'm thinking i'm thinking is there anything else we can do on this island because um i don't want to go back here unless i absolutely have to i just bought the um dragons so we should be okay oh crap he's coming my way let's go up here i think there is one more thing we can do not entirely sure though might be tricky stay away from me will you well he just runs here go away Look at the big dragon. You don't want to anger the big dragon, do you? Go away. That's the right course of action, sir. Just move away. <gasps> there is, look at that, there is an experience shrine up here. Well, I have no idea how to get up there, do I? No, I don't. Okay. There is a little guy coming, but that should not be a problem. Because I have a plan of biblical proportions. Oh, there is another crystal I didn't get. I will get it later. I think there is... I have something in the, in the corner of my eye that we can do. But I'm not sure. I think that's a longer thing to do. Um... I think it has to do with the giant. This guy here. A long time ago. Is there any treasure here? Apparently not. Nothing. Okay, tell me about the abyss. I want to enter the abyss. Ah, yes, yes. A while back, a black dragon backed me to let him down into the abyss as desperate to enter as, as you he was. This dragon happened to be a powerful magician equipped with all manners of enchanted object, but he was not equal to the power of the abyss, and the abyss consumed him. Artifacts and all. I've always wished I could recover the dragon's cape. Well, for these past days no creatures has been born from the abyss if you could descend to the very bottom and bring me back that dragon's cape i'll return in return i can give you a book i found recently in the stomach of one of the creatures i've destroyed is that a deal that is in fact a deal but i think that will be a story for another day will it yeah, yeah, don't make them too long, they say. So we stop it here, and next time we'll go into the abyss and fight demons. Hopefully not. Until then, bye.